tree. Nothing here. Nothing there. What? Right, see? Nothing here. And then nothing down low. <clears throat> we have actually got something on the floor. Actually, it's stronger on the floor. Do you have any information on this field we have been looking into, please? Right, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Is this person young? Are they middle-aged? Are they younger than 25? Are they over 25? Okay. You make a flash on this one? Thank you. Cheers. Okay. Do you want us to help this person, please? Yeah. Are you trying to trick us into helping this person? Trick us? No, he's just saying all this stuff so we'll help someone specifically like trying to find and they want you know, is his spirit trying to get us to go and help someone like? Do you know what I mean? So it's a lot to... just for one person though, isn't it? I I don't know. It's... No, not the field. What we can do. Oh, right. Do you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying, Jadon? Yeah. Like trying to say all this because they really want us to help them because it, it have happened before. Haven't it? Yeah, that's happened before. So, are you trying to answer these questions so we will help someone specifically? In the case of lying to us, well, there's no activity there. We've asked them questions. It's nothing, right? So let's ask a question for an answer. Are you trying to tell us this because we are looking for these answers and we want to find the answers to this field? Are you trying to help us find the answers about this field, please? Are you telling us because it is very important that we help this person regarding this matter, please? Right. That's what they tell us that we will feel. It's because we need to help this person. Oh. Are there other people like this person that can do these things and manifest these things, please? Is this person's ability awakening? Is that what's happening? Is this person's ability awakening and becoming stronger? Can you tell us that, please? That's a no, then. Do they know what they're doing? With regards to the paranormal, do they know what they're doing? Have they always had disability? Right. Can you so affect you know, this one as well? Sorry, yeah, put them both that together. I haven't seen it, but it's yeah. not coming up on camera. Yeah, it did. I just saw it in my own eyes. Thank you. Um, put them together, like so. Hmm. Right, so this person has always had disability. Has something happened to this person to cause them to cause this field? Something? Yeah. Right. Are we something? Was there a passing of a loved one? Has it been mistreated? Is it a relationship breakdown? Right. Are they sound of mind and body? Yes. I, no, I thought of something else. What do you think? Are they being influenced by something negative? Right, yes. Is this person possessed? Is this person being in, 
influenced by something negative, please? It was just one fucking pig. Yeah. Is this person being influenced by something else? Can you tell us that, please? Is this person being influenced by something else? Yeah. Right. Is it human? Whatever she's been, in, if she's been influenced by, is it human? Is it demonic? Yes. Is it extraterrestrial? No, it's demonic then. Yeah. I asked them the same thing. Are they the same? Is demonic and extra extraterrestrial the same thing? Damn reptilians. <laughs> yep. Um, still, I, I apologise if you are on the up and up, but I am still slightly sceptical. So, but, okay. Thank you. Um, is there something we should be doing at the moment about this? Yes. Let's go back and review the evidence then, is it? See what we've got so far. Is there anything... Yes. Is there anything else that you wish to tell us before we end this session? Try out again. Is there anything else you wish to tell us before we end this session? Yes. Okay. Are we going to meet this person shortly? Yes. <coughs> Before the end of April? In May? In May. Okay. Uh, how are we going to contact them? Yeah, how are, we going to, how are we supposed to contact them if we don't even know who they are? Do you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> um. Once we've had this person, will the field stop? Yeah. Will they need like an ex will they need like an exorcism? No. Will they need healing? Yeah. Will we hear about this person through a third party? Yes. Yeah, we got it. It's very low, but it's very it's a similar sort of thing. You've got a proper pulse in there, but... Mm. Zoom in on that. There we go. You always just pulse in. Uh... Oh yeah, my battery's slightly low, guys, so that is why the green light on the front, the green light there, is dimmer because the battery on the K2 is running low. Upon revisiting some of the properties that were affected by the paranormal activity that was manifested by this field, or which this field was manifested alongside, most of the cases have been resolved to the satisfaction of all involved. I can say that in every instance, everyone involved has been empowered by the experience. 
either by gaining more knowledge of the paranormal or gaining more knowledge of the spiritual side of themselves. So irregardless of whether the nature of this field is a positive or negative influence, the benefits as to our involvement in investigating the effects of this field, I feel, have been largely successful. Though the precise nature of its origin remains unexplained. Since April of this year we've had one incident which which you've just seen which was on June 10th 2016 where the field has been present though once again that instance has been resolved. You will in future episodes see more detail about the field we've picked up because some of the cases highlighted in this presentation will be shown in more detail. With regards to the conversation of which we had with the spirit entity you've seen in part 2 and part 3 of this presentation. We were definitely communicating with something but whether or not the information given was correct as to a person being responsible for this field remains unexplained. However, there have been some startling similarities of which I cannot go into in order to protect the identities of some of the people involved. If anyone has any constructive arguments as to the nature of this field after watching these presentations then please feel free to add some information in the comment section below or contact us directly through our websites which are paranormalnow.co.uk and spiritualworlds.co.uk If more information becomes available of which we can release to the public then we will do so in a future presentation. Thank you very much for following this episode of Paranormal Evidence Archives and we will see you next time.